we were able to create our account. So let's now add the ability to log in once we exit the application. So we're over here in the log into account and the program host. This is super easy. We just have to get the email from the user like this. So we'll say something to the fact of, so we're going to log in, ask them what their email is, and let's go ahead and do a strip and a dot lower on this. And in fact, let's always store that. So I'll go back up to our create account and do that here. So strip takes all the white space in case there's like a space or something on the end. And lower, of course, makes it lowercase. So then we just need to see if the account exists. Well, we actually already wrote that. So let's say this. Um, say the account is the service not find account by guess it email. And then we'll say we add a little error handling, say if not account. Say error message. So nothing there. And if it worked, all we have to do is save it and maybe say you've logged in. Yay. So let's uh, say state dot active account is account. And then we'll do a success message. Logged in successfully. And then our little prompt will change straight away. So that should be good. Let's try this. Come over here to the host. Let's try to log in. And remember, there's no real passwords. We're just sort of playing around with accounts here. So Michael at talkpython.fm. Boom, logged in successfully. Awesome, and you can see the prompt change. Let's try to log in again. I'll try to just use jeff at j.com. Nope, could not find email with jeff at j.com. Looks like login is working.